Hi everyone, it's Janice. Welcome back. Welcome to another Get the Look video. If you've missed my past Get the Look videos, I will link them down below. I have done a Get the Look video for Jackie O, Audrey Hepburn, and Blair Waldorf from the TV show Gossip Girl. But today's Get the Look video is going to be Emily Thorne from the TV show Revenge. And she is played um, by the actress Emily Van Camp. If you don't watch Revenge, I definitely recommend it. It's one of my favorite shows. But the premise of the show is the character Emily Thorne is out for revenge for the people who have wrongly accused and taken down her father of being responsible for a terrorist attack. And the show takes place in the Hamptons among the wealthy. And it seems that the majority of the show always takes place in the summer. That's just kind of what the writers have done with the show is that it's basically always like revolving around the summertime. So I will show a few different uh, examples of things that Emily Thorne wears when she's out and about in the show in the different scenarios, and I will also include footwear and accessories. So uh, one of the looks that Emily wears a lot is just kind of like a dressed up casual look. Um, so this is just like a striped blazer. She would wear this out and about. In the pilot of the show, she's wearing a red and white striped Tory Burch sweater. So here's just like an orange and white striped Michael Kors blazer. This would be something that she would wear. She also just wears like neutral blazers a lot. A white is definitely her signature color on the show, but she does wear um, other, other shades as well. And she's been in several episodes wearing a navy blazer, just like a very classic look. And like I said, white is her signature color on the show. Emily has like a million white sweaters or cream sweaters that she wears when she's just around the house, particularly like a cable knit sweater, fisherman sweater, whatever you want to call it. Like I said, the show takes place in the Hamptons on the beach, so she has a beach house and a lot of times it shows her just relaxing in like a cozy white sweater or also like a white cardigan. Now she does wear um, other shades that are neutral that are not white. One that she wears um, in particular I noticed is kind of like a gold shade or like a like a cream shade almost and even though her character does not really wear prints um, occasionally she's worn prints but they're very like understated I noticed that she does add sparkle to some of her clothes so a few of the tops that she have worn um, that she has worn have been like a like creamy gold color that had some sparkle so a little bit of visual interest added to her outfits without adding a print so her whole character is really a facade she's playing um, she's trying to make people believe, you know, that she's someone she's not. So, and part of her look is really like the all-American look, the very innocent look, um, like, no, she could never be the one responsible for things. So she goes for very, like, classic all-American clothes. Um, she does not wear anything trendy. She's very sophisticated and very simple in her clothing as well. She's not over the top at all. Like, my last video was Blair, and I told you how Blair is very over the top and mixing prints. Emily is like the opposite of that. So she has worn a chambray shirt in a lot of the episode on a lot of the episodes just with like white pants. She also wears uh, striped shirts. Like I said in the pilot she wore a striped sweater and she also will wear like a rugby t um, rugby striped top as well. Now Emily has another side like I said I, I don't want to spoil too much if you haven't seen the show but I mean it's pretty obvious even if you watch the first episode that she's not who she says she is. Um, but she also kind of goes into like kick butt mode where she's basically physically taking down her enemies sometimes and not just like with the click of a button on a computer screen. So she does have a lot of like black athletic wear that they will show her in when she's kind of just keeping up with like her workout regime or she's actually like physically taking someone down. And she'll also wear like a leather jacket, just kind of like her kick butt outfit, like I said. Now, footwear on TV, I've noticed, is really hard for me to notice because a lot of the time the cameramen are focusing on the face. And even when it shows someone like walking into the room, they're not really showing their feet. So I had a hard time trying to figure out what kind of shoes she wears. But they have shown her in a lot of episodes just like in boots, in like tall boots. So Emily would not wear like little stiletto booties. Like I said, she's very classic. She's going for the good girl, all-American kind of look, um, but she does wear boots that aren't too tall, like not over the knee, but more like this length. And when she's at like a business meeting, she will wear just like a sensible pump. This is just like a navy pump. And for accessories, I do have a couple more clothing items to address for her. Um, she keeps it very simple, just one or two accessories. So she may just wear like a watch, 
Um, I wanted to get, I still haven't found the right one. She will wear a tassel necklace sometimes. And for earrings, she will add a pop of color in her earrings a lot, I noticed. And she does not typically wear studs. She will wear, like, drop earrings. Um, these are more like a, they're not really hoops. These are like a circle in a color. I'm not sure if you can see them. But that's more her style is just, like, one or two accessories. She doesn't do any of the arm party um, kind of looks. Very classic. Now, a lot of her lifestyle, so her character does not have a job on the show. And there's always, like parties going on in the Hamptons and her look is a sheath dress basically so Emily does not wear anything even though she's going for the good girl kind of look she does not wear anything like overly girly like I don't think I've ever seen her wear pink or purple on the show and she doesn't wear like a full skirt or um, you know an a-line that's not really her look um, but she does wear red a lot in her colors um, or in her dresses especially so she wears a lot of like white sweaters um, she'll wear like striped tops and then like red dresses she also of course has worn like a black dress so this is like a just sleeveless sheath dress and this is a classic cut for Emily um, we do have similar um, neither of myself or Emily Van Camp have hips so um, the kind of cuts that I see her in on the show I'm like, oh, that might work for me too. So she's definitely like an inspiration to me in my fashion. So this kind of has like a little faux wrap and she will wear a lot of dresses that kind of have this like faux wrap. And she doesn't really have a statement or a signature neckline, I would say. She does wear a V-neck a lot, but she's also worn a lot of like halter or one shoulder dresses in the show. There's a lot of parties on the, sh on the show. So she's worn a lot of different party dresses. So this dress would be probably a little too pink for Emily's taste but the cut is exactly right so she does wear dresses with sleeves if she's at like a business meeting again she's going for like the sheath dress very streamlined look and then she if she's at a party she will wear more like a fun statement shoe um you know with maybe like a peep toe or like a sparkle um so like I said this shade might be a little too pink a little too girly for Emily's character but the cut is right um, please let me know in the comments if you watch Revenge, if uh, you have a favorite Emily Thorne look, I would love to know. And I'll see you guys soon. Thank you so much for watching. I am going to do another Get the Look video, so stay tuned. Bye!